Welcome to some Hockey Ultimate Team action here on EA Sports. I'm James Sabalski, and these are a couple of fun squads. I'm looking forward to this. Both these teams look ready to go, as does the official. Let's bring it on. The Giants win the opening face-off, and we are underway with this one. Right in the low slot. Sends the feed in front. Oh, and they couldn't complete that. And now it's grabbed by Burns. Gets it over to Jarvis. And the puck escapes oh. the zone, and they'll be forced to tag up. Here he is on the backhand. Spectacular stop by the goaltender. How did he hang on to that? Love the way the goaltender gets tight to the shooter here. The puck's in the low slot. You want to take away time? You want to take space? Oh, this looks dangerous. A pass. What a save. Oh, my goodness. I thought they had it there off the rush. They've got the defense outnumbered to his teammate. The Hurricanes have it behind the cage. Takes a hit. He goes down to the ice and coughs up the puck. The Giants gain possession along the wall. Can't hang on to the puck after taking a knock. Along the half wall with the puck. McDavid's working it around in the corner. They got a stoppage. Let's get the call. The Hurricanes are off to the box. Interference the call. Man advantage takes to the ice. It's our first opportunity to get a glance at the special teams unit. Scoreless game right now, James, but an opportunity on the power play. You have to find a way to convert. Move that puck quickly and open up lanes. And he elects to play the puck. He got all of that hit. The Giants gain control of the puck against the wall. Into the corner now. Denied by Kuchetkov. This is a dialed-in goaltender. Very aware. Knows where the shooter is in that low slot and makes the save. Too much traffic in the lane. Let's it fly. Great save by Kuchetkov. Carolina's on the attack. Burns is up and ready to go. And a strong effort on that play. Icing is the call. We'll get a face up at the other end. Getting closer to the halfway point of this frame. Still no score in this one. Back underway, and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. The pressure's on the defensive side of the puck, but they win it clean, and they have an opportunity right away with the tired group that they're playing against. Oh, and it just gets a piece of it to keep it out. Quick feed to Makar. The Giants have it now. And that goes off a player. Now a quick pass to Makar. What a steal in his own end. The Giants have the puck now. Drills them. The Giants have it in the offensive zone. Gains control of the puck here at the blue line. Moves it to Weber. Pumps it away in his own end. Scores! And they tuck it into the hey, back hey, of the net. Hang on there, James. I think they waved this off immediately. This goal is not going to count. Play set to resume, and you can see they're still frustrated by that non-goal call. And off the draw at center, they take control of the puck. Picked up along the wall by Mitchell. Along the wing, up the neutral zone. Sends it out in front, and that goes off a stick. Here's a short pass to Aho. Look at this, they've got some bodies here on the attack. Slides it over with pace tonight. And that's picked off by Burns. Rocked on the play. Look at this, two on one. Slows up the play and takes a look. Here he is, wrists it on net. Denies him in close. And he takes the pass. Oh, tries to pick his corner and puts it off the outside of the post. McCarr has been effective getting to the right places at the right time, but it hits the post. Scores! And they make the most of the time remaining. Well, it's a buzzer beater there, James, and they are now buzzing heading into the intermission. You know that's carried momentum, but they'll have to find a way to start the next period the same way they ended the last one. 
The Giants have finally opened the scoring here in the first and not a moment too soon. This has been a bit of a defensive juggernaut, James. We've been waiting for a goal call all game long, and yeah. we finally get it. And what this does will give them some confidence heading into the intermission. Fire it! Fire it! Quick stop! Oh, at the buzzer, a big save! There's the horn, ending the first period. Both teams will have a chance to regroup. You do you, and we'll be back with period number two in a moment. Well, let's see what period two has in store for us as they are about to drop the puck. The second stanza is underway as the puck is dropped. Let's go. All right, Pounder, how would you assess this game through the first 20 minutes played? Carolina's trailing in this game because they haven't had any urgency around the puck. They've been chasing the game, and they haven't had any possession time. Gets down to knock it away. Here we go. They've really ratcheted up the intensity here now in the Ozone. aggressive and at the top of his crease and makes an outstanding save from the slot. Scooped up along the wall by Stahl. Moves the puck. Solid check to slow him down. Works it across to Martinick. Great feed from the left side. Big time hit check there. That's how you finish a play. Here's a chance on the attack. Puck grab by Lemieux. Well, it almost looked like he converted a quick release shot. He had no time or space, but unable to put it by. The Giants gain control of the puck. Carolina's in on the offensive attack now. Can't keep a hold of it as he's jostled off the puck. Taken along the wall by Tara Vinen. Oh, so close, but an even better defensive stop. Well, I love the attempt here at the Michigan, but when you're below the goal line, there's two things you have to be aware of. How much time and how much space you have, and he didn't have either, so it clearly wasn't the right choice. The Giants get a hold of the puck in the open ice. Driving right to the front! Scores! Nathan McKinnon! The Giants have padded their lead now, extending it to two here in the second. Well, you're over halfway through the game now. You've got a healthy lead, but you got to find a way to keep the pedal to the metal, if you will, James. You have to put the gas on. You want to attack. You don't want to sit back and give them any life. Nietzsche will play to the corner. Answered the call on that play. Grabbed along the board. It's a two-on-one. Out in front. Smart defensive effort to break up that play. And he takes the feed. Quick pass to Chatfield. There's a shot. Oh, how did he get a piece of that? Carolina's got it behind the net. Through the offensive zone and behind the net now. Moves with the puck at the corner. Heads to the back of the net. Can't complete the pass as it goes off a stick. Kucherov's crossed the line and gained the zone. Scores! They strike again, and that's three unanswered goals. Over and over and over again, James, and you can see the excitement on the bench. They know that they've deflated, and they push their opponent back on their heels. They need to keep bugging away here and not get complacent. The Giants have made it a three-goal lead, and as we near the finish line of period number two, this is starting to feel a little insurmountable. Well, there's been a ton of offensive production and opportunity, James, and they've capitalized on it because they... And she's taken down! Penalty coming up! Well, the official had to make this call. I mean, she's in all alone, one-on-one -on -one with the goaltender, and then all of a sudden she gets tripped from behind. The shooter lines up. Here we go. Oh, look at this. Makes the stop under pressure. The Giants continue to lead here late in the second period by a wide margin. Carolina's won the draw. 
Now he slides it up to Nosen. And the puck departs the zone. Pass across to Kopitar. Here's a chance. Big stop just as time expires in the period. There's the buzzer bringing the second period to an end. Been a great night of hockey here on EA Sports. And we've got a third period just around the corner. Welcome back to EA Sports. The final frame looms here as the officials set to drop the puck on period number three. It's been a total mismatch here as we get underway for the third. Let's see if anything changes. Well, two periods down. Here we go with the third period. Cheryl, your assessment so far. Carolina's got to get the puck, James. I mean, to put it in layman's term, one, you got to get the puck. Two, you got to score. They're not doing either. And that's offside stopping the play. The Giants are on cruise control here in this third period, leading big. And after the draw at center, they've got a hold of the puck. Good check, frees the puck up. Pad save, and he made it look easy. Great job there. Dishes it to Stahl. Carolina's got control of it now here in the offensive end. The Giants play it along the boards. Tries to the crease. Scores! And that's four in a row, and they are rolling tonight. Well, the whole bench is rolling. Why? Because they're all getting goals and apples at the stats tonight. You can feel the energy as they're all standing up. They've gotten four in a row. Well, that goal just ignites a fire down the entire bench, and, and sometimes it's about the drive and the energy within a shift that can just change the course of an entire game. There's so many ebbs and flows and momentum shifts. This one is one of them. Across the line from center. The Giants look to start the transition game. Oh, look at this chance. Moves it to the middle. Another pass. Dishes it off again hustle, here. Hustle. and there's no give there. Well, there isn't, and you can just feel the rumble of the boards from up here. Just bone crushing, separating body from puck. Scores! And the pylon continues, and these home fans, I think, have had about enough. Yeah, they have had enough, and they paid money, and they're leaving the building. Why? Because they are frustrated with their team, just a lack of effort today, and just getting blown out of the water. Lemieux won the draw at center. The Giants carried along the wall. It takes a shot, and that's broken up. Moves it to the middle. Oh, and he comes up with a stop. Here's a blast. Face-off coming up as the puck goes up and over the glass. The Giants are in the home stretch of this one here in the third period and lead by a wide margin. Can they take advantage after winning that draw? Heiskanen's got it along the wing. And that ricochets off a twig in front. And he slides it quickly to Lemieux. He got all of that hit on the play. Makes his presence known on the ice. Quick pass across to Drury. It's a contact sport, people. There's proof right there. And he takes the feed. Here's a chance in front. He's in tight to the net, James, and he knows that he's not going to have much time or space to get it off, so he elects to use the snapshot and beats the goaltender. The Giants are sending a clear message that they are not taking their foot off the gas in this third period here, Cheryl. Well, you can certainly tell that they bought into the game plan, and the coach is certainly ecstatic with the performance of the entire bench. I mean, look at the way they're moving and holding the puck, attacking the net at the right times. It has been a seamless effort. The Hurricanes take it along the wall. Here's a shot! A shot! Oh, what a great club save on the play! Allmark's been able to watch the goal. One on one with the goaltender. Scores! That's how you finish! This entire play is fantastic, James. Speed, reading the play, and he recognizes he's got a ton of time, freezes the tender, and carries it home. The Giants continue to bring up the score here in period number three. Well, it's just been a terrific collective effort. Now they're on the home stretch, and the coaching staff 
has a real opportunity to utilize their bench, rest their star players, and this is critical when you're in a long season. McCoy's moving the puck to his own zone. Quick pass to Heiskanen. Inside his own end, moves the puck. Sends it over to McCoy. Quick feed to Heiskanen. Takes the puck and will retreat back to his own end. Poked away in the offensive end. Wrist shot from the slot. Oh, what a save as he denies them again. Well, he has been under siege, and I'm loving his compete level. I mean, he's making consecutive saves one after another. Easy pass save made by Homer. A chance at the rush here. Here's a pass. And that's broken up by a great defensive play. Picked up along the boards by Shea. Pesci's got the puck. Takes a spill out of the ice and loses the puck. Moves it quickly over to Kucherov. Tonight, the puck was like a beach ball. He saw absolutely everything, and he was in perfect position all night long.